waiting patiently. Okay, you want to shake? Thank you. You want a high five? <laughs> this girl's waiting patiently because we made cookies again tonight. But this time we made, hang on, don't be greedy. Sit down, please. Thank you. We made pumpkin. I'll break this in half. So, I probably should have used maybe a little less pumpkin. <laughs> Hang on a second. Oh, okay. She can't help it. She's like, I'm so excited. Um, as soon as she smelled it, she come running over to the kitchen. I had the gate up, of course, so um, she couldn't get in. Um, these are a little... I, I don't know if it's because we rolled them out just a little bit different. A little bit thicker or if the pumpkin just makes them I don't know I feel like they're softer um, but this dog is absolutely she, she likes both honestly Aww. Um, but I usually do break them in half um, on a video once before I talked about I leave containers of snacks around in case say she grabs something off the floor or a large string or something that I need to get back. Um, we do do leave it and that does really well, but sometimes they'll get something and they, you know, they'll take off and they just don't want to come back. Um, I keep little containers from the dollar store like this and we keep these sitting around. Um, so when I groom her, I grab it and I just give her treats now and then. Um, this one stays in the bedroom. Um, from time to time, I keep one in the sunroom near the hot tub outside, and um, she's been knocking it over, trying to open it up, but I just thought I'd give you guys an update. If you had ever decided to make a pumpkin cookie, she's going to lay there patiently thinking, I'm going to take the lid off. Um, I will tell you in the recipe, it's the same recipe I used before. Um, on the video it says Nala likes cookies. Um, two and a half cups of whole wheat flour. One teaspoon of baking powder. Um, I used one cup of peanut butter in the peanut butter recipe. Look at her, she's knocking it over. Um, I used one cup, eight ounces of pumpkin in the pumpkin ones today. Um, I used, honestly, a about two tablespoons of honey and you can use one egg I did not I'm allergic to egg I used what they call egg replacer um, I feel like the and I baked the pumpkin cookies a little less because um, I felt like because I have a small oven and a large oven I felt like the oven was so warm so I took the time down by a minute on each side um, the recipe calls for 350 oven for uh, 20 minutes. I, however, did 8 minutes on one side. I spun my tray around and 8 minutes on the other. But I did feel like they were getting a little done. Not bad. Um, and I can show you some more of those. But on the pumpkin ones, I did a little less. I did 6 minutes on one side. Um, 6 minutes on the other. This is a pumpkin one. I can tell the color is lighter. Stop. Hang on. Hey, don't be greedy. Don't be greedy. Let's put the lid back on real quick. Hopefully I grabbed two different ones. I'm not sure. Oh, I did. Hang on. Stop. Sit. So, pumpkin, peanut butter, and she, trust me, does not care. She likes them both. You ready for your close-up? Huh? Ready for your close-up? But, yeah. So she knows I have another one in my hand. She's going crazy. I'll just give it to you. So, do if you do this recipe, I end up having to add about a quarter cup more whole wheat flour in the pumpkin recipe. Um, do about six ounces of pumpkin and keep your whole wheat flour at two and a half cups. And then I did end up adding... Um, a big glob of honey, additional honey. So probably about another tablespoon. Um, 
but I think they turned out really well. When you use the paddle attachment, you want kind of a thicker ball of dough. So when you put it in the fridge to cool, um, it just makes it easier to roll them out. Um, so if you do this peanut butter recipe and you see what the consistency of, that's the consistency you want your pumpkin to. Um, so the peanut butter, one more time, two and a half cups of wheat flour, one teaspoon of baking powder, one cup of peanut butter, preferably organic. I did not have organic. Um, one cup of water, uh, just over a tablespoon of honey, one egg or egg replacer in my case, 350 oven. It says for 20 minutes. If you have a regular full-size oven, 20 minutes is probably fine. If you use a small oven, um, I have a double oven stove, so my small oven's tiny. Um, I use the tiny side when I do a lot of baking. So I honestly did 16 to 18 minutes, and they were fine. So um, my recipe for the pumpkin, I added 8 ounces of pumpkin. I would have taken that down to 6 um, because I did have to add a little bit more whole wheat flour, about a quarter cup. And then I did add additional honey. So, um, really they turned out well, and she's going crazy. And in fact, she's sitting here with drool running down her mouth because she's hoping I open this thing. I'm going to put these up on the dresser because she's hoping for more. Um, guys, we have been purchasing dog treats, and she has a favorite. In fact, I've probably mentioned it before, um, but here lately when we fill her Kong with a specific brand, she started throwing up like a little every time we gave her her Kong, but the common denominator was this one favorite treat. So we stopped feeding her this one favorite treat, and she has only gotten sick once, and that day she got sick... The other day, she was outside, and she ate wood chips out of the flower bed because we have been cutting through the flower bed to get outside because of the ice and snow. Um, and for some reason, if you allow her to, she will eat a wood chip. So I don't know what it is about wood, but um, she hasn't been sick since then. So we're not going to buy this one particular brand anymore. Um, I bought it at Walmart. Um, we're just going to ixnay the cheaper dog treats. So I made her some a while back using the same recipe. She loves them. And we thought we'd go ahead and make some more. And it was so funny because as I was baking, she come running up trying to get in the kitchen. I had the gate closed. And she was disappointed she couldn't get in the gate. So she was talking back. Um, I'm going to hang, hang up here. Say good night, everybody. Tell everybody, say it's bedtime. I'm tired, so I apologize. I was trying to think about what I needed to say, but I'm exhausted. It's been a long day. The weather's been crappy the last two days, minus 34 degrees. It's going to warm up. I'm kind of excited about that. So I'll talk to you guys soon. Hit like, hit subscribe, and please share with your friends because I really, I'm up to 50 subscribers, so I was really excited. I know that doesn't sound like a lot, but for me it was. So, hey, help me get subscribers to my channel. So, videos uploading. I've got like four to upload in the next few days. It takes a long time because where I live. So, I will be uploading animal stuff as well as other things. So, I'll talk soon, guys. Bye. Say bye, everybody. Say bye. <laughs> bye, guys.